so much news coverage, it's difficult to shield our children from what happened in Orlando. Yeah, we talked to some caregivers today who shared their approach to tackling a tough topic like this one. It's scary. It's scary as an adult. It's scary for kids. Um, but I just think that as long as we teach them and um, we are aware and that's the best we can do right now. At any given day, anything could happen at any time. So we just really, as far as people, have to be mindful of the situation of what's going on in the world and be not afraid of what's going on. Do not, do not let nobody stop you from being yourself or being who you are in life. That's the best thing I can tell my grandson. Clinical psychologist Dr. Josh Claypo also offers this advice for talking to children about tragic stories that they see in the news. He says you should listen to their questions and their fears. Communicate that it's a difficult topic and you want to know that they are what they're thinking and be sure to ask them open-ended questions to let them drive the conversation. Dr. Josh also says that it's important that you don't shut down the conversation with your child when they say something you don't agree with. He says this is about helping them heal, not a time for debate.